Hola, mi amores, my kitties. It's your girl, Ashley Alyssa, and you guys already know the deal. Yeah, I got home from the grocery store and I decided that I was gonna make something and I was like, hmm, what am I gonna make? And I wanted something quick and easy, so I decided to use the crock pot because I've recently fallen in love with a crock pot. Mind you, I've had one for I don't even know how long, but I never really used it. I was never a big soup eater, like, you couldn't get me to eat a soup, even if you pay me, especially when I was younger. The only time I would eat soup, it was like if I was sick. And now I've recently gotten into soups and stews. I feel like they are filling. You just throw them over like a bowl of rice or some quinoa and it's super healthy. It's hearty. It's filling and you don't feel like super bloated and you're just literally taking in so much fiber so many like amazing nutrients for your body so i decided that i was gonna film what i'm gonna be cooking today all right so this is super raw and uncut don't mind my messy kitchen i mean it's really not a mess it's just all the food and all my vitamins and all my um fiance's like supplements and whatnot so if you don't know about juice plus get into it <laughs> um but I have some chopped up red potatoes that I'm going to throw in there, some vegetable broth. I have some rainbow carrots, some minced garlic. I was going to do some butternut squash, but I'm going to save that for later on in the week. I'm going to throw in some zucchini. I'm also going to throw in some cauliflower, so I'm going to chop that up. So far in here, look at that, yum. There's some minced garlic, some red onions, some cilantro. There's also um, a medley of some peppers that are in there. And that's basically gonna be my ingredients and like my seasonings. And then I'm gonna just throw everything in there, add the vegetable broth and voila. <laughs> As you guys know sometimes tampons could be a little toxic and they just have a lot of you know synthetic stuff that really isn't good for our beautiful little energy core that we carry down there so i'm trying these out and look how cute he is to strong woman comes in like super cute little jars so after you're done you can refill it or you can use it for something else so i'm trying these out and i'll keep you guys posted guys look at that Look at that. Look at that sizzle. Ooh. Yes, mama. It is it's today. Today's Friday and it's seven o'clock. And I gotta show you guys what I got. Look at those fries. And I got Cajun fries. And then I have cookies waiting for me. <laughs> what? Turn up! This is what my Friday looks like. It's Friday, so I decided to treat myself. So I'm about to literally devour. I'm like, my mouth is salivating as I'm like looking at it right now. And I'm going to eat. And I got some chocolate chip cookies that I'm going to like throw to get warmed up. And your girl is going to relax for the rest of the day because then I work really early tomorrow. So... Yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know. My life really isn't like super exciting and eventful during the week because I'm working all the time. Um, but yeah, I'm going to let you guys into my life and I'm going to let you guys in into the things that I do. So I just got my nails done. Yeah, let me look how cute these are. Of course, lighting won't focus, but like blood spatter with like little moons and stars and whatnot they're mad cute so <laughs> good morning my kitties uh, apparently i have a little too much energy right now but it's okay um i'm just making some avocado toast i'm gonna drink some tea and then I'm going to get my day started. So I'll probably bring you guys along. Um, 
I have to do just a little bit of shopping. I'm probably going to go to the hair store real quick. Get some extra hair because I don't know what I'm going to be doing for this. It's kind of like a trap festival that this is our second year going. It's pretty much our last festival because your girl's getting a little old for this shit. So. And then I'm probably going to take you guys to the mall as well too. And I just got to go to Forever 21. So I'm going to take you guys along with me. I'm going to wash this hair because I mean, what is this? <laughs> it's a rat's nest! <laughs> so I'm gonna wash it probably uh, throw a braid in throw some hair in there and then um, you know do this cara make this face look pretty er and I am back and ready to go so are you guys feeling this hair are you guys feeling this hair and this highlight, so um, obviously this is not my hair. Um, it is pretty long, sorry for the mess in the background, but I actually just sold my desk. So I'm gonna be getting a new vanity soon. And just in the process of that, so, and just decluttering and getting rid of a bunch of things. So excuse the mess if you do see it. As far as the hair, her name is Tati, all right? She's extra long and curly. And Tati, tú no le puedes decir nada because ella ni puede con ella misma. So, um, yeah, she's feeling herself. She's looking cute. And I'm just waiting for my boo to get home from work. We're going to go to the mall. I actually ended up not going to the hair store because I thought I was going to need something from there for what I was going to do for my hair on Saturday, but... I already have a hair piece that I could wear that day, so I'm just gonna go with that look because no need to spend unnecessary money. As far as makeup, I decided to use this amazing palette. I mean, <laughs> look at this! This is actually from Tarte and it's the Love, Trust, and Fairy Dust. Um, I got this for my birthday, also from Angie, so thank you, boo, uh, for blessing your girl. And this is the look that I came up with. And these lashes are some of my favorite lashes. I'm constantly wearing these lashes because they're super lightweight and they're just like wispy and really cute. If you guys want to know what lashes these are, comment down below and I will let you know where I got them. Um, just a little secret, I got them off Amazon. <laughs> Shout out to <my> kitties. <laughs> uh, all right, so we're headed to um, Forever 21 right now and hopefully we get something cute. So. Oh my gosh, that's like me right there. Like. Oh my gosh. I remember growing up and going here. Um, I need that, eat that. To the guy on you the, want. The escalator on the escalator, really? Look at you trying to be part of my vlogs now. Okay, by the way, if you guys are looking for a cute lingerie for Evan 21, it is popping. They got like the cutest lingerie. Oh, this is cute. Look. This would be mad cute, right? I know, but I want like the lingerie. I don't know, this one's kind of calling my name with some black fishnet. I think this would be really cute. Look at this one. Look at this one. What are you doing? What are you doing? So, Forever 21 was a success. I was able to get what I was looking for. And yeah, we're just going to have to live with it what we got and now we're gonna go over to Zoomies. Oh, she's so cute guys. Oh girls that's the good stuff. <laughs> Ooh. 
t-shirts galore. So we're back home. Um, we were supposed to go out to eat, do something, but we ended up just coming back home. Uh, I wasn't feeling that good, so she was kind of feeling a little indecisive and didn't know like what to eat. So she was like, let's just go home. So um, I still don't know what she wants to eat. It's like 9 o'clock, but I haven't eaten dinner. Now that I told her, we're going to go get some food. You guys don't even know what I'm going to get. And you guys are probably going to judge me. But it's fast food but it's one place that i can actually eat that's fast food besides like taco bell and i don't even want to do taco bell anymore done it i get it here and there but i'm so over it um we're gonna go to dun 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 burger king because burger king has like a veggie burger there so at least i could get that and fries of course so it's just something quick and because we really just don't want to make anything to eat and i've been eating my rice and stew for like three four days i need a little bit of a change and monday we go back to eating super healthy again and back on track but this weekend everything goes to shit right baby oh my god you are such a grumpster right now. She went from being like super duper happy to just like. <laughs> so we're outside. Oh, I didn't show you guys my outfit. Well, now you can see it. <laughs> Cute little claw. Yes, queen. Yes. Yes. Hey, Tati is still lit. Shanae is in the house. Her name is Tati, short for Tatiana. Ya tu sabe. All right, so I wanted to show you guys what I got at Forever 21. It was only literally like three things, but. I figured since I took you guys to Forever 21 with me, I wanted to show you what I got. And I'm like out of breath right now. Burger King. All right. I got some fishnets. Because um, a girl can't be without fishnets. Fishnets can be worn in so many ways. You can wear them with shorts, skirts, you can wear them with bodysuits, whatever. So I got that. Um, I got just a simple little bodysuit. Bodysuit like this. And you guys already know with the bodysuits, I always say I like the thong closure because it's just, it looks more flattering. And then last but not least, this was for um, these little shoes right here. These are mad cute. They're a size seven. Typically I'm like a six or six and a half, but I got them a little bit bigger because they do run a little smaller, at least for my foot. And I got these because I wanted some cute like little shoes for work or whatnot for when I didn't want to wear little heels. I can wear flats and it still looks really nice because for my new job, I don't have to wear scrubs anymore. Your girl gets to dress up again because I just feel like when you get to dress up for work, you know, scrubs are great and all, and I loved them for a while. But I just, I feel like when you get to dress up for work, if you look good, you feel good, you know? I was going to vlog this weekend because last year I did do a little bit of vlogging for Rare, but honestly, I'll probably just vlog before the event. Also, I am going to be planning my wedding. Uh, we start next week also, the day before I start my new job. Um, we're going to go look at venues. So if you guys want to see my journey of, you know, the wedding planning and everything, you know, I'll give you guys bits and pieces and what I'm learning because honestly, like, I don't even know all the steps that there is to planning a wedding. If there's any advice that you guys have, please let me know. 
that's that. <laughs> it's basically what I got at Forever 21. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. So have a good night. Deuces. So this is my dinner tonight from Soho Juice Co. If you're in like the Orlando Winter Park area, check them out. They have bomb ass acai bowls. They're famous for the Cloud Nine one, which is Cloud Nine, which is my favorite. But I decided to get this one for me and Booski for dinner. Right, Booski? Thanks, my love. Oh. Her, she was my um, roommate for oh, yeah. <laughs> when you were in Chicago. <laughs> yeah. How is it, babe? It's fan fucking tough. Good. 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 I'm a salmon. Oh, yeah. oh. Well, you these know. are fire at David Plus <laughs> here. Do you guys see the boat that I'm doing with? Look! 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 We got Angie, the boo, squad will be meeting up later. And like I said, I will not be vlogging at Rare this year because I'm just trying to have fun. And we trying to look cute. And we trying to stun. Mm. Okay. <laughs> trick. Okay. <laughs> well, I will catch you guys probably later on or tomorrow. Love you guys. Look at this whole setup that i have going on right now so this is my lazy monday my recovery monday i ordered a tostada guac i have my own peach mango salsa from public so if you live in florida ooh, my voice keeps kind of fading if you live in florida and you have a Publix, try the Publix brand peach mango salsa it is fire um these are my own chips which are the Benito's white chips, bean chips, and they have a hint of lime, and they're so good. And then it came with rice and beans, so I am about to devour this thing right now. And I'll probably go into a food coma and end up taking a nap, but it's perfect because it's raining. It's raining outside. Tree? Yeah. <laughs> oh, savage. Do you want another one, Dynasty? Be nice. Hola, mi gente. So today is Thursday. And I am getting ready to get a facial by my girl, Kelly. I'm going to get something done. I don't know what exactly, but... I mean, my skin doesn't look too bad, but... I know that it could definitely get better and as an esthetician you never feel like your skin is exactly where you want it to be you always feel like it could always be better but um i'm excited i've never had a treatment at a med spa so that's even more exciting and we'll see so i might be able to film while i'm in there i'm not sure but um if not i will let you guys know once i'm done girl kelly's room and i'll keep you guys posted on the treatment that i end up doing hello well your girl is definitely red af um but honestly i think it looks worse than it really feels i actually had two treatments done i had dermaplaning which it actually removes the vellus hair on the skin which vellus hair is kind of like that little peach fuzz that's on your face it removes that while also removing dead skin and let me tell you there was a lot of skin and hair removed uh i never had dermaplaning done professionally but i've always wanted to get it done because i do want to become certified in it and honestly the results were amazing when she showed me how my skin looked after it was 
incredible like your pores look smaller i mean just skin looks so much more even and brighter and then she went ahead numbed my face which if i'm talking a little weird it's because my lips are super numb uh i had microneedling done all over my face so microneedling is great for anyone who has suffered from hyperpigmentation acne scarring who wants brighter more even skin tone plumper skin the best way to explain microneedling is they use a pen that has little needles and the needle basically punctures like little holes on the skin which is also going to draw blood when it draws blood that means that now your cells kind of go on to this overdrive of repairing themselves and now you're producing a crazy amount of collagen production which repairs your skin so now new skin starts to grow in and all these cells regenerate themselves so your skin is gonna look a lot plumper like she went ham on my smile lines and my smile lines were super super prominent and I was even feeling like maybe one day I'm gonna have to get fillers you know because I just I my makeup was setting in my smile lines and literally like you could still see them but they're not as visible. My skin definitely looks a lot plumper. Of course, there's a little bit of inflammation, not too much. And it literally feels like a, like a sunburn, like a bad sunburn, but not that bad. Overall, the experience was amazing. And the place that I actually went to, um, it's called Advanced Dermatology and Cosmetic Surgery in Altamont. And I went to my girl, Kelly. I will definitely be getting more dermaplaning done. Once I get certified, then I'll probably be doing it on myself. But as for microneedling, that's also something that I would love to get certified in as well. Honestly, I learned so much from Kelly. Kelly, if you're watching this, thank you. Thank you so much. Honestly, you're super professional, so knowledgeable. She makes you feel completely comfortable. So... If you guys are interested in knowing more, I will actually, in the description box, I will write down the information from the location that I went to. So I'm doing a recovery mask while I'm watching YouTube before bed. Good morning. Today is day two. Um, after getting my microneedling and dermaplaning done and right now all I have on There we go a little bit better light. All I have on is a little bit of tinted moisturizer and the post care products that she recommended and My skin doesn't feel as tight. There is a little bit of tightness which is mainly like in the smile lines area where she worked on a little bit more but overall, my skin feels pretty good. There's still a little bit of redness. I can tell that there's just a little bit of swelling like right in this area. But overall, it does not look bad. I do look a little pale, I feel like, rather than the rest of my skin. But I think it's from the sunscreen and also the layers of dead skin that she took off. But so far, so good barely any sensitivity at all um i didn't use any type of powders no primers anything i literally just cleansed i used a hydrating spray freaking train um hydrating spray and the gel that i needed to use the recovery gel and sunscreen that's it and only a little bit of concealer under my eyes and since I really couldn't do much makeup today, I went ahead and just did brows and threw on a pair of lashes and calling it a day. So, yeah. The vanity bar for dressing with all the emergency supplies mini break room over there and a fabulous restroom. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, the J <laughs> And then that's where we usually put the screens. <laughs>
Which one? Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know they have everything. Look at those bamboos over there. I am back and basically um, I just came back from a photo shoot I'm sure you guys will be seeing the photos soon on Instagram here's dynasty saying hello say hello see hashtag kitty gang woo, woo. Um, anyways so I did a photo shoot this week has been insanely crazy um, I got my makeup done by a makeup artist. Typically, I do my own makeup for all photo shoots, but um, I tried something new this time. I just kind of wanted to do a quick little outro video. What is that? Um, okay, I guess that's just my bone. <laughs> I just wanted to make a quick outro video. I didn't want to just end the vlog like this. The vlog is basically everywhere. This is just like a week to a week and a half in my life, how things have been. Uh, my life could be pretty boring sometimes and just super chill or it could be extremely crazy so it's been like that for the past few weeks so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog if you guys want to see more vlogs of my daily life and my weekly life let me know uh, I hope you enjoyed it don't forget to hit that notification bell so you're notified each and every time that I post a video don't forget to comment, like, and hit that subscribe button. Nana, hit that subscribe button and show some love. And for all of you who have been rocking with me from the very beginning and who are still rocking with me, much love. And I appreciate you guys so, so much. And per usual, I will see my kitties very, very soon. I love you, mi gente.